co-operator of a Kendallville daycare is facing a child molesting charge. That's a level four felony. The man was arrested last Wednesday. Wayne 15's Taylor King went to Kendallville today and spoke with two people who work at the daycare. She joins us with what they said. Taylor. The Junior Jungle Daycare in Kendallville is run by Robert Neese and his wife Vicki Neese. Today I knocked on the door of the daycare where two women answered, one holding a small baby. I asked them if they had any comments about the child molesting charge against 55-year-old Robert Neese. They declined to comment, but however, said Neese is innocent and there is evidence to prove it. The following details of the story can be disturbing to some viewers and not suitable for young kids. According to court documents in July 2022, a detective with the Kendallville Police Department was notified by the Department of Child Services of a possible child molesting. The DCS has indicated that the parent of the child victim said she was touched inappropriately while at the Junior Jungle Daycare. A child forensic interviewer at the Bill Lewis Child Advocacy Center interviewed the child victim and said the following. The child victim said Nice licked her and stated he does it, quote, all the time. According to the probable cause affidavit, she said this happened in the toy room and in the bathroom. The child victim went on to say Nice and her were alone when the acts occurred and that her pants were also down during the acts. Later, the detective interviewed Nice, where he denied any inappropriate touching. And as we said earlier, Nice was arrested last Wednesday at the Junior Jungle Daycare. He was released from the Noble County Jail Monday on bond. Nice is also charged with resisting law enforcement. I did speak with the lead detective on the case today, and he said they were hoping Nice would go willingly, but did not go as planned. Kendallville Police could not comment any further since this is still an ongoing investigation. Taylor King, Wing 15 News.